Hello everyone, my name is Alex and in this video I will show you how to make a virtual machine with Ubuntu on VirtualBox. In the first place we need to open Google Chrome and search for Ubuntu. Then we will press the second link. Then we will press accept all and visit site. From here we need to choose download Ubuntu desktop. After that we need to choose download 24.04 latest version. Then we need to wait until the download is complete. After the download is complete, now I will create a folder where I want to store the virtual machines in the future. So for me, the folder will be created in local disk D. Press right click and new folder and I will choose the name virtual machines. I will open up the virtual box. I will press new. I will choose the name Ubuntu or whatever you want. Then I will choose the folder where I want to store this virtual machine. For me, it will be that folder created. Then I will choose the ISO image from this path and as far as you can see the virtual box detected that this ISO image is actually Linux and the, the version is Ubuntu so press next here we need to put a an username and password so I will choose to put admin for this tutorial as also I put a password same as the username you can put whatever you want then I will press next and here I will choose a value of 8 gigabytes for base memory like this and for the processors I will choose 4 and then I will press next I will leave as the default here and I will press next I will check every single information from this list and then I will press finish here we have the settings for our virtual machine and the virtual machine is powering up. Here we have the setup for the installation of Ubuntu. Here we need to choose our language. For me, I will choose English and I will press next. Uh, also, we have a lot of options but personally i will press next now we can select our keyboard layout for me i will choose english and i will press next if you don't know what keyboard do you have you can press detect also we need to be connected to the internet for additional information to be installed on your virtual machine now we will press next we have a chance to update some features, but for a moment I will give a skip. Now what I want to do is to install Ubuntu, but if you want to try it before installing, you can check this box or you can just press install Ubuntu and press next. Here we have two options. One is interactive installation, which will help the users for uh, a proper installation. And here we have automated installation where uh, advanced users can install in their way. But because you are a user that, that you didn't play before with Ubuntu, I would suggest to keep the default and then press next. Also press default selection and you have the chance to install additional softwares if you want. But for the moment, I will leave unchecked and press next. Here we have two options. One is to erase disk and install Ubuntu. And the other one is to do a manual installation. But personally, 
for the moment i will choose erase disk and install ubuntu and press next now we need to create our account i will choose a simple name like alex and i will choose a password please make sure that you enter a very strong password if you have this green check mark here that means everything is all right and then you can press next now you need to choose your location and also your time zone for me it will be bucharest and after you complete that location also ubuntu it will detect that your time zone is in europe bucharest then press next after that here you will have a list with additional information about the installation and now you can press install now we will need to wait now we need to press restart now after restarting the ubuntu now we have the user that we created before so i will press on that user and i will type the password be aware that this is the password from the ubuntu not the password from when we created the virtual machine now we are in the ubuntu and here we have a message from the ubuntu by itself so let's press next and see what is here we have the chance to enable the ubuntu pro but for the moment i will not do that i will press next i will press next and i will press finish and this is how you can create a virtual machine with Ubuntu on your PC, on your Windows. You can right click, create new folder, you can access the terminal by pressing right click on the desktop, opening terminal, and here you have the access to the terminal, you can close it, and you can do whatever you want, you can access the menu from here you can install apps from here from the app center or you can do whatever you want in the ubuntu if you want to close this virtual machine you can just simply shut down the ubuntu from here by pressing this button and choose power off then the system will power off automatically in uh, 16 seconds or if you don't want to wait just press power off or cancel if you don't want to power off the ubuntu i'll press power off and the virtual machine will will close and if you want to power on the virtual machine you can just click on it just like that and the virtual machine will will start thanks for watching and see you later goodbye